Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby, and we are back with more Minecraft the Epic Mod Pack. We are continuing, just finishing off this little building here. This expansion of the house. Like, sorry, expansion of the house. So we can start doing Thomcraft. Now you might be thinking, why do you have to build a new room for it? Trust me, there is a lot of Thomcraft items and things that... I'm going to need a much larger room than this later. But I want to just get it started with a nice cool little room like so. And I will most likely have stairs going up here to the second room. So I, I, I kind of like, you know, usually when I make stairs, it's always like as high up as quick as possible. But I like having it like go, you know, have a, have it travel a little bit further. It looks awesome to me. All right, there you go. Okay, so what do I need to do to finish this part off? Um, One more high up, I guess. Hmm. I am missing some things here. I need some more stone bricks. I think I have some extras. Let's see, let's put the seeds away, let's put this away, the iron nuggets, um, let's see, I have to put a lot of this stuff away. Uh, good, we have some st extra stone bricks, which is exactly what I needed. Um, there you go, it's almost night time, isn't it? I am going to put down this bed here. Hey, look, I have a third, I have a second bed, yep, I do. Um, okay, let's go ahead and start doing this a little. One, two, doink, doink, wink. Um, okay, one up like this, and stone brick the side like that. It's nighttime, I should sleep. Yeah! Alright, I love sleeping next to my machines. God, these NPCs, I swear to God. It's gonna happen one day. They're all just gonna be in my house looking at me. They're kind of like Hero Brian, but right in front of your face, you know? Remember when Hero Brian was a thing? It's actually, it still kind of is a thing. Or at least the people at Microsoft. I was going to say Notch, but he doesn't. He's not the owner of Minecraft anymore. But the people at Microsoft are trying to keep Herobrine alive. Honestly, if you guys look at the latest update as of this video, um, you know, on the. It says a uh, version. Oh, it's episode. Oh, sorry. Version 1. Point, whatever. 1.10 or something like that. But it's like the last um, message on the change log is like Herobrine removed. It's like, ooh, Herobrine, huh? Yeah, they wish. Here, Brian is uh, it's not a thing anymore. No one talks about it. No one. Well, I think there's still a mod, and it was a pretty cool mod. If you don't know what it does, it actually added Hero Brian the game. Um, if you don't remember what Hero Brian is, it's a uh, that's a little story people made up about Notch's dead brother, which isn't a thing. I mean, it's not real. But then Notch heard about it, went along with it, and then in uh, in an update. He's like, oh, I removed Herobrine because people have been, you know, he's been haunting the game. But yeah, there was a mod made as a little awesome tribute of it where Herobrine would actually, like, it's a mod you only add to just screw yourself over. Like, it's it's pretty much that. It's like just to scare you and mess with people and make YouTube videos probably. It was cool. It, he would just wreak havoc upon your world in lots of horrible, horrible ways. It was like, it was really bad. All right. Let's do this. Two, three, four. All right. So, um, let's see here. Like this. Does that look good? I think that looks good. Yeah, that should be good enough. Perfect. Let's get rid of this. Awesome. Look at that. Would you look at this? Let's get rid of these wood. This, this wood. These woods. And we will put this wood there. Nice. Cool. So, um, I guess I will put like some sort of painting here later. We should open this up a little bit. Yeah, we should we we could open this up. Nice, very nice. Oh, making my house look so cool. All right, let's put some awkward planks. I missed the outside one. As long as it looks good inside, yeah, I don't care about the outside one. All right, so now that we have our room, our expansion room. Actually, we we'll open up one more. Yeah, we can do that. Look at that, it looks so cool. All right, stone bricku. Nice. Ah. It looks so homey. I'm so happy. It's not just a giant square. It's now an expanded house with a square on it. Okay, so let's begin. Continue, rather, with Thomcraft. So, you gotta put down your wooden table like so. Use your awesome, awesome scribing tools. You can right-click the research table and look at all this stuff. What the hell does this do? Let's go ahead and read the Thomonomicon to find out. So now that we have, okay, our table can turn into the workbench. Stone table for workbench too. Oh, that's cool. They added a stone one. They didn't have that before. So now we have the research table. Let's go back to this other tab, which was research. So 
Um, to craft a research table, blah, blah, blah. The recipe for the thumb and eater and scribing tools will be shown later. Okay. So research, research, research. This is a lot of stuff here. I'm not going to... Well, I could go over it. But it would take a long time. Alright, a thermometer, excuse me. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. So pretty much, I'm just going to quickly try to summarize this. So as you can see here, it tells you everything here. Um, you're going to get paper. There's going to be aspects here, and you're going to be combining it together. Um, it's mostly like a minigame puzzle where you have to connect things. But the thing is, um, the only way to continue playing the minigame is to use aspects. And aspects do not refresh unless, you know, at least that's what I've come to come to come across so I most likely will have to go look up actual um, recipes to finish these recipes I know that sounds weird but like the specific mini games that give you certain research and uh, the research is usually always the same I think I could be wrong okay I'll, I will read this later off though but we just need to build everything to do it so one glass two shards of anything and two golden ingots so let's craft this this is another item that is absolutely necessary without this you cannot do thumbcraft at all so which i have the most of this air shard so we'll go ahead and do that and i need one hmm, let's move this we don't need a lot of this anymore let's put this away oops i put it in the wrong freaking chest i swear i, I swear I, I clicked on the right one guys i clicked on it we need one glass for it. One glass. Uh, let's put the wood away. Keep the cobblestone, I suppose. And uh, half the wood. What's what's that doing there? When did I put that in there? Okay. Uh, dee bop dee do I do. Okay, what was the recipe? Again? I I'm so sick. Oh, stop. 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 Okay, here we go. Bump it up. A thermometer. This is so cool. Please don't crash. So you hover over it, and you can right click. You just right click on it. You have gained Herba. You have gained Practical Nar, Nar Fabrico. You've learned Terra. Let's see. You've learned Vacusio. Nothing new can be learned from this. Uh, let's see. You Knowledge of Lux. So we really just need to hover over everything. Let's see what we got here. Perdito. Census. It's really important that you just quickly, quickly learn the stuff. Potentia. Um, so there's a lot of, like, I'm going to be, like, just doing this for a while so we can see what's going on. And what's really cool is you can also throw stuff on the ground and research that, too. There we go. Instrum. Instrum. Oops, let's throw this on the ground. Uh, Kongo, Vestitia. Uh, nothing new. I wonder if we can do Pokemon. I think, I think you can do Pokemon as well. Let's get rid of this. Boom. Now, this is absolutely different from what I'm used to. This, like, this is not what I'm, like, this is new. This is a new type of UI. I've never seen this before. Um, okay, so I need to make, okay, so it's my scribing tools. I need to put paper on here, I think. Let me read the book. Okay, so I hope there's one on, here it is. So this is basic artifices, primal charm. This is used for a lot of stuff. Um, I will teach you how to use this stuff later. Here is a mundane amulet. Here is a mundane ring. There's a lot of this stuff I just don't need right now. It's all for other stuff. But let's learn the measuring. Okay, so thermometer is the most important tool. Firstly, scan objects and creatures. You simply need to click new information. Secondly, they display the current base aura in the chunk you are located. Holding F allows you to change what aspect of aura it displays. So holding F. Now, that's okay, the F part's not working because I changed the controls, so we're going to have to look at Thomcraft here. Thomcraft, Thomcraft, where is that? Is it even on here? It better be on here. Um, a miscellaneous. Here it is. So, I actually don't know which one was the F. Was it this one? That's the G. Wand toggle. This is really important. I need to, I'm going to put the H for that. And then, um, H... Which one was this? Wand focus? This one was it. So this is H. This is J. H and J. So I'm going to press, press H. Showing air levels. Showing Ignis. Showing Aquas. So you can see in the top left, depending on where I'm standing, depending on the chunk I'm in, it's going to tell us the power levels of the area, which is cool. Which is nice. 
Oh my god, we have literally zero vitium levels. And this is our all of the ratio levels, which is awesome. So there you go. Let's keep reading this thing. What else? Okay. The aura displays. That's it. It's not telling us anything else. Okay, so you can see here this is the next sort of stuff here we can learn we can learn this next we can learn all of these next oh it's so cool and there's i think there's more tabs you can uncover i'm not too sure about that okay but let's go ahead and you need scribing tools and paper to get this research note so i don't know how to do this um you have to make another set of scribing tools so we will do that right now uh and paper we have a lot of paper so i don't need to worry about that so paper um we needed ink Ooh, this is our last ink isn't it oh boy but yeah welcome to the world of thomcraft magic is there's a lot going on here um oops don't need the paper you need the feather and the glass file for the scribing tools okay so click on the thomonomicon there you go research note has been added to the goggles of revealing so pretty much it's just like a tree of stuff you want to learn right it's just a tree of stuff so I'm, I'm relearning a lot of this, and there's a lot that has been redone. Like like I said, the Stomometer, it used to be different. It used to be you hold on to it, like you, you hold right-click, and then it slowly zooms in, and then poof, you learn it. But here it's like you learn the basics. You learn the basics. It's like, I don't understand. So I'm learning with you, but thank God this book is here. We can kind of get it. Okay. So we pretty much learned the goggles of revealing research note. You put that in here, and now you have to combine these together. Ah, oh, now here's the thing. I don't know how to get. I don't. I don't know how to obtain more aspects. I don't want to mess this up. So I'm gonna read the Thaumanomicon and see if they have any um, advice about getting more aspects. You know, um, um, aspects here. Aspects of magic. Don't crash. Is the game gonna crash? Thank God. Okay, two main primal and compound. So uh, these are all the basics and compound. You of course put them together. So Terra and Aqua equals life, etc. Okay, so it's all close to 40 known ones being scroll all the time. So I wish it tells me how to get it. Um, to view an aspects, hover over and press shift, you will see, okay. Aspects have been separated, note is vis, blah, blah, blah. Vis is bound into wands and liquid, essentia is liquid. Okay, so these are all of my known ones. So you combine, there you go, look at that. Oh my God, it tells me everything. Like hovering over it shows me everything that I can get census out of, which is actually pretty cool. But I, it doesn't like, mm, I need a way of like knowing how to get more, you know? Auras and nodes, new enchantments, the peck, deep ores, hmm, research is power. Um, research expertise, we just learned research expertise. If we just right click it, you can see here there's a little durability bar. Every time we learn something, it will uh, use up a little bit of the durability which is fine i mean come on what else you could use it for okay so let's get a crafting table we'll build a small little um chest here specifically for thumbcraft stuff because we're not always gonna have everything here for it okay so i guess we can just see look at this look at that okay so what we're going to do is combine these together now i oh, crap i'm gonna read this again i don't want to mess this up okay Look at that, it has a percentage of completion, which our goal is to get 100% in all of this stuff. Um, so teach me how to research, please. Teach me how to research. Um, which one was it? Was it this one? Research. Okay. How to research. You need to carry blah, blah. When you open your thaumaturgy, we're good, we're good. Flashing squares means you can pursue. When you click on one of these, okay, you get it. You can now take it to the note. Okay, so one, which is describing tools, and two is where the research is. Okay, three, four, and five. Okay, three will show you a number of primal aspects that you have available to complete. Section five, which is this, will display a sheet of paper covered in hexagonal tiles with the aspects around the other edge. On the outer edges. To complete your research, you simply need to connect and activate all of the aspects. You do this by dragging an aspect to a hex adjacent to it that is either composed of the target aspects or can be combined with another aspect to form the target aspect so you can see here this is a instrument and humans use instrument and humans are kind of related to beasts beasts are related to life and life is related to this and whatever that is so I'm, you gotta have kind of an idea of what's going on okay placing an aspect consumes one research point see there it is i hate this it consumes a research Ugh. 
and we only have five of each right now. It's not good. If you make a mistake, you can click on it. Should you ever run out of research points, it is best to discard the note and create a new one to get a fresh pool of research points. What? That's new. That never happened before. We can get new research points by discarding it. Okay. Th that's never happened before. This is new. To get the compound aspect required to complete most researches, you'll need them. You need to combine them from their primals. This will be explained later. You continue doing this until you have formed a pattern connecting all the starting aspects. The outer aspects need not all be connected to others. They simply need to form a connected whole. Okay, so as long as they're all connected somewhere. Once this is done, the research will complete and the discovery note will turn to discovery. Note, placing and removing aspects from the hex consumes inks. Okay, refill it. Combining aspects. Simply click on an aspect you wish to combine and drag them into area 4. Okay, knock. Component aspects are not consumed even if the combination doesn't result in a valid compound aspect. Mm, oh god, uh, I'm a little confused. Hexagonal icons indicate secondary research. Most like primary, you just need to click on them. You will, instead, you will simply learn the rest of the research directly. Secondary research. Exploration. While many researchers have available from the start, require knowledge, you just by exploration. First thing you need to do is construct a thermometer. We've done that. Exploration. Once complete, you will be notified if you discover a clue. The exact nature of a clue might not be immediately apparent. Check your thermometer. Usually, new research discovered will flash with amber icons. Okay, let's attempt this one. It shouldn't be that hard. Okay, so energy, <laughs> census, orum. So I'm gonna go ahead and combine these two right here. Now we have life. I don't know what else we can combine. I need to have like a little note here because I kind of want to all like do this all legit. Um, so let's get rid of these. So what works with the census? I actually have no idea. Um, can we combine? these two together there we have combined air and ignis and now we have lux which is light census or uh, energy power what about this okay you see that we made a mistake it doesn't connect and we got rid of it that's pretty stupid I hate that so much I really hate that what about order and this that creates exchange power exchange not working it didn't connect it did not connect so power and exchange didn't connect <sighs> I'm gonna have to I really like I'm not kidding like it's gonna take forever for me to figure this out I will most likely have to look up the stuff so I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up guys cuz I do not want this to take like forever okay so thumb craft research notes um, for the goggles are revealing Goggles are revealing. So it's going to teach me how to do this, I think. Yes. Possible research. There you go. Okay, so the research. Ooh, this is different. This is different. This is a much different picture than my other one. Uh oh, that's not good. Yeah, it's different. That's no bueno. Um. What aspect is owl one? Interface of this. Uh, you scan things with Google's the thermometer. All right, hold on, guys. I'm trying to figure out how to use. This. Does anyone know how to get more? Because if I run out, I'm screwed. You know, this is terrible. I hate this. All we have to do is make another research note, right? Let's just mess with this and see what happens, though. But I can kind of understand here. Okay, let's just go with the basics. Let's go order with, so this should connect. This should connect. Okay, that connects because census works with air. So the one I'm looking at, it's not fully complete, but I can maybe try to finish this. So there's another one here. Okay, so freaking Aram works with air. Census works with air. I'm gonna write this down. I'm gonna write this down. I'm gonna freaking act like a, act like a freaking researcher here. I'm gonna see what connects. Okay, so I'm going to open up a new notepad here. And yeah, I'm actually doing this. New notepad. I'm just going to be a research thing. Okay, so. So let's see. Census works with air. 
And then this other one here is called a Oram. Oram. So Oram. And I'm going to put these in alphabetical order. Oram works with air as well. So everything I do here, it's going to show, it's going to show. Also works with air. Now we got to see what combines with air, etc. So potentium. I mean, this is one of the first things. So I'm going to assume it's you know going to be easy. Let's try um, fire. Ooh, potentia works with ignis. Okay, so potentia. Potentia. That works with ignis. Just so I know later on, ignis. All right. <sighs> Can't believe I'm doing this. All right, now what combines all of this together? I'm not sure. Maybe the order of everything. No, so it does not work. Let's try water. No. Life? No. Earth? No. Did I try water? Here, try the water. Did I try this one? Okay. I need a new, um, I need, I need to combine them all. So I think to combine them, you're going to need, let's look through the, the research notes here. Let's see here. So these are the ones that I know of. It's going to be, and I don't know it. I think it's a little bit of magic, and I don't have magic yet. Um, Ignis Primal Asics Machina. Um, so yeah, can someone give me like tips and hints on how to do this? I'm, I'm gonna keep doing. I'm gonna try to finish this one right now though. Um, so let's see. Okay, so Oram, Oram. Oram works with potential in air. And the other one was census, right? So census. Census. Ah, uh, air and spirit. So, okay, so if this is an owl, I could use only these two for it, right? Is that, is that how it works, right? That's how it works. So, I don't know how to combine the rest of this stuff, though. It needs to be something that shares. Oh, oh. It needs to share ignis and air. So something in here that combines both of those together, right? So Ignis and Air. Oh, Lux. Lux. Oh, okay. Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. So Ignis, you combine it, and this goes in the middle. Oh! Oh, I figured it out. Oh, we're not stupid. Oh, we're not stupid. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Goggles are revealing learned. So now that it's learned, we can craft it. Yes, goggles are revealing. Oh, I'm so happy I figured that out. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. That's really cool. Okay. So, what is this? How do you craft it? I'll show you guys later. So, I'm going to end it here. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps so much. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Upload a lot of daily videos. I'm going to continue playing this tomorrow. Now, I recorded in bulk this episode and the past two before. So, I want to ask you guys... Any tips for researching at all? Any tips for getting more research and aspect points? Now, the next two or three episodes might not address your answers because I'm recording in bulk, like I said. So, just so you know, I, if I ask questions, I will read your guys' answers. But it just not, might not be in that specific video. In the next video, because I'm research, cause I'm reading it later. So, help me out with any way you guys can with Domcraft stuff. Um, so, if you guys enjoyed, you know, leave a like and I will see you guys next time.